Hello, my name is Nick Davis with Team Davis Remax Premier Group. We live and work here in the Tampa Bay area. What we'd like to talk about today is how to sell your home when the interest rates are rising and the market is cooling down. First thing we'd like to say is don't sweat it. While the interest rates can affect the buyer pool, if you do everything that we talk about here, you should have no problem selling your home while the interest rates are high and the buying pool is low. Reason number one, price it right from the start. And this is the thing that we always, always stress to our owners is that you have to price it for what it is. If your house has upgrades and the comparable homes that we look at don't have upgrades, well, that's a good thing. We may be able to price your home a little bit higher. Now, flip side to that is if your house has not been updated or maybe been updated 15, 20 years ago and all the comparable homes have been updated like recently, well, you cannot ask for the same list price as the homes that have been updated to today's standard. Make sense? First impressions are key. And like I said earlier, pricing your home based on its current condition, updates, upgrades, um, things that may need to be done is key. Setting the buyer's expectation when they walk into the house can make or break the deal. And I will share with you a quick example that happened this past week. Uh, we listed a home. Um, it was the original owner. House is in good condition. Nothing wrong with it. Been maintained. But it hasn't been updated. And we recommended a list price to the owner. And initially, they said, well, we were hoping for a little bit more. And we said, we understand but based on the conditions of the market, um, the condition of the home, the homes that sold for more were updated and upgraded to today's standard, and we're not, so we need to price it here. And they agreed. Well, I, I lost count of the amount of showings we had um, over this past weekend, and we have offers on the house, and it's going to go under contract today. So... House went on the market Friday afternoon, under contract Monday morning, because it was priced right for what it was. Reason number two, you always want to highlight the value beyond the mortgage. And what I mean by this is the interest rates are just a piece of the puzzle. We focus on the unique selling points of your home. Recently renovated kitchen, stunning backyard, or a great school district. We have to be careful with that because ratings on schools change frequently. These features will always add some value um, to the client. Maybe not a monetary value as far as, you know, price for you, but focusing on these key features are things that will assist us in getting your home sold. Reason number three, we showcase the move-in ready appeal of your home. Buyers want a house that they can move right into. They don't want projects. Now, granted, some do. Um, we do professional photos. We do professional uh, video on your house to show the current condition because this way it's not a surprise when people show up to the house. I've seen listings um, with one or two exterior photos, and it always makes me wonder what's going on inside. Um, we have seen ones with really, really blurry photos, but we want to showcase your house in its best form. So we invest in professional photos, professional video, um, drone photography. If you live in an area that we can fly a drone, we will get drone photos of your house as well. Reason number four, emphasize long-term investment. We've talked about this, building equity in yourself as a buyer, you know, not paying rent, not throwing money away every month um, on rent, putting money in your own pocket by investing in the equity on your home. Buyers still see this as a positive thing, even though the interest rates are high. Remember, they can always refinance down the road when the rates come down. 
Reason number five, partnering yourself with a skilled realtor. Partnering yourself with Team Davis. We've been in the Tampa Bay area since 1998. We've been selling real estate since 2005 here in the Tampa Bay area. We've sold a couple of our own properties. We've purchased a couple properties while we've been here as well. We know the area. We know what's going on in the market. We keep our finger on the pulse. Um, I tell people all the time, we're not part-time. We are not full-time. We are all the time. We work when you're off. We work when you need us. We are here to help you sell your home for the most money with the most favorable terms in the fastest time available. That's our job. Our job is to sell your home. It's not to list your home. Some other people may come in and say, hey, we can sell your house for $50,000 more than Nick and Cindy said. And that would be great if it was true. Chances are your home's going to sit on the market um, because of all the reasons we talked about earlier. You know, when people are looking at this price point up here and they're expecting certain things, and they come to your house that's priced here but should be priced down here, you're not going to have the features or the upgrades that the houses have at that price point. And people are going to come in, and they're going to walk right back out. Remember, even with the higher interest rates, there are motivated buyers out there looking to purchase a home, and you want to be on their short list. You want to be the house that they make the offer on. So... Give us a call at 813-300-7116 and we'll go ahead and put together a comparable market analysis on your property. Come sit down with you, go over everything with you, um, and get your house sold. So hopefully you found this video informative. And if there's something you'd like to know more about, Go ahead and leave a comment down in the comment section and we'll go ahead and make a video specifically for you. Please do us a favor. Go ahead and click the subscribe button with the notification bell turned on. This way, anytime we make a new video, you'll be notified immediately. Talk to you soon.